coming on. We're doing cows. This is basically a setup on the roof that I got to work on. See how my hands are. This is it. Inside the hole.
NR233, 564th. We got seven minutes, basically 10 minutes, blasting it out. I still got adjusting to do. I'm running super hot. I'm at 26.5. So, but uh, yeah, it ran good. I'm, I'm not a fan of doing comps places with 233, but practice makes perfect. But uh, yeah, it's all good. You guys work hard, work on this flux core. Uh, gotta love it. I'm proud. I just want to give you a little check this out stuff. 305 Pro Gun. Not a fan of it. I like the K126. Or should I said that gun is a K126 Pro. I don't like it. I like the classic K126s. Uh, these are your aftermarket. Uh, what the hell are they called? Pro facts. They get the job done when K126s aren't in stock. Here's the old shields from the past. This here. That was a long run. I always did this stupid stuff. When I'm burning hardcore flux core, I'm, I'm not using my pipeline. Aftermarket for the K126. These are the Lincolns. They're the freaking best. You can actually, if you're doing tubes or a tough spot, after running a couple passes, you could stick this into a bolt hole and bend it and get like, that's the short. Uh, this comes in handy, especially underneath on the diagonal tubes that are like real tight to the floor in the freaking hole. Another one. You can see the difference. That's it. I'm running this freaking LN25 iron worker. It's, it's okay. I, I like the original LN25. I call that the classic, but this thing got torque. It's blasted. You know, so I'm out. You guys have a great weekend and the other side i'll probably do 70 uh 18 532 but have a great weekend burn wire it is what it is man later